demands there be a minimum amount of raisins and raisin bread. It's true. Says so on the back of the champ's bag of raisin bread. <laughs> Don't worry. You're not bothering the champ. You see, a lot of people find the U.S. government's involvement in the allotment of raisins to be quite ridiculous. But not Chad Deity. No way, baby. You see, Chad Deity knows it is not ridiculous. Chad Deity knows this is America. We deserve the best. The best economy. The best armed forces. And the best champion. You see, that's the American dream. That's what Chad Deity stands for. And I, for one, as the champ, am glad to know that the U.S. government agrees and sees it my way. Mace. You of all people in this room should be able to relate to the American dream as it pertains to raisins. Since your people fought for, protested, and boycotted for the right to pick grapes. <laughs> you know this whole no word thing you're doing? The champ approves. Not a bad start. Sure, for now. But eventually they're going to come to him and they're going to want him to say something. Then what you going to say? Hmm? Yeah. See, you ain't got the raisins, brother. See, right now you're giving them bread with no raisins, and they're all excited because it's new and it's different. But then eventually, when they want the goods, they're going to see that you ain't working for French toast. And they're going to see that you don't work for cream cheese and jelly. Then they're going to come looking for the raisins. <laughs>